Amen. Take our Bibles and open to Genesis chapter 1, verse 1 to 3. Verses 1 to 3. Genesis chapter 1, verses 1 to 3. In the beginning, God created the heavens and, and the earth. The earth was without form and void, and darkness was on the face of the deep. And the Spirit of God was hovering over the face of the waters. And God said, let there be light. And there was light. Amen. As we are aware, see the name and you may be in a Science and religion. If you see who said, a body in your answer, and they are some, do they have some conflict? And I say, I did parallel, and I said, Quenbu or Swa, is it that when you become a scientist, you no longer believe in religion, or you don't believe in, the, in God that we serve? Does science answer all the uh, questions that we have as humans? And what does science see, and where, what are the limits of science, and what are the strengths of the Bible? Uh, as we said, we have our pastor, Pastor Comrade Donko, to give us insight into these things. And I believe that by the end of this presentation, we'll have addressed our minds, we'll have addressed our minds in some of these things which border us in, so, in different ways. So without much ado, I want to invite Pastor to the floor. Elder, I thank you very much. Medail Darcy. Um my presentation be a struggle so with sada struggle na ye material but elder my name be some several times just say my ba sorry mu a check a card here but me nim ni pay at the hey nti my wonder is say okay presentation be a o dwene wo audience no ni pa na dia sem no come on mu na me hwem a me me nim scientist na wo ha na be say elder say where is this coming from just say who has this problem and he, um, I have been struggling with that. Um, and so was it Wednesday or Thursday? And I'm sure I said, Elder, I prepared it now. I'm going to say you better take cheap shots. A very easy self. I can say, oh, science for no mom, slow your men home there. Oh, my yeah. Okay, you can adopt that approach, but I don't think that is the way we should go about it. I think we should do it seriously. Now, we should place ourselves in, in the place of the scientists so we can at least begin to have a, a, a glimpse of their struggles. Um, <laughs> once a general conference, honor, institutions in me, you know, uh, near our biblical research institute, you know, yeah, you know, you say, yeah, share Bible, my Bible, no, I get clear, say, as a fununion as one or Bible, no. CP. But apart from Biblical Research Institute, near what Geoscience Research Institute, um, the only a scientist, almost so but I say, I can afford GDT to creation the Sabbath, no, um, be placed on a solid scientific foundation. Now, to be very honest with you, I thought that's you know, Mushia no more Casa, they struggle. 
because it's easy to belong to the scientific community and still continue to believe certain things. So I want us to know, sir, it is not an easy subject. To make catch I say I'm not going to make it too cheap. Metiasia uh, say. This may fly over our heads. That's fine. <laughs> Secondly, me scientist. In fact, my formal training in science ended in 1972 at Bekwa Secondary School. Me formal science I taught a lot of videos, multi teaching company, on all kinds of scientific issues. But that is not formal. Me a scientist. Some of those concepts in the me can say me tiasie fully me boa, but my interest is in what we call the philosophy of science. That's a different subject. I know, dear, you are looking at the way scientists think. I hold dear, me a little interest or until that is approach ya, ya to be fast. Until me say say we are no angkasa, but be a bro yes no, the emphasis ah the be tiasie and so. I assume, sir, I mean, see, trust in your mumpy. I don't see your one. When our dear Bishia, who will be be our year, ever will be bearer. Then you said, Nay and hey, it's not going to be wasted. What career on the Sassian, you know, dear Sir O'Brien, Finfinner, Boy, and what the same, a faster show when you're young, a way you see Monty. Amen. All right, Prof, let's go. Science. And religion, duet or duel? Duet or duel? Southwest too, no duet. I know they see any. First time I would see duet, and then I would tell you, "Mute for Adiye, I knew it too. I see only a duet." I'm said being an Abigail name, sister back on you mean you didn't papa. Caroline, I've been an omo yen. They were doing a duet. Omo omo compliment each other back to soprano back on to all the minimum say no mean touching ya. It works nicely. Brebia u kasa a dear we want some. You are talking about a relationship. And name you know be. But you can't do well. And the idea. So science, ne religion, no. At the say, Abigail, ne Caroline, or to say, Mark Tyson, <laughs> what is it? Okay. All right. Okay. 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 I didn't think I said you're doing a sound of women, you know. I said you know me because when we're giants, I thought that some of us were saying that you have very two strong characters. Now, more I'm bringing about reconciliation in the assembly. So when you're giants, you know, sir, saying that you're doing a sound of women, there will be a problem. Both science and religion are very powerful forces. In any culture, in the contemporary culture, I mean, you are not going to be able to throw science away. I do hear me cry more here, cause I do hear the boy. The science. Um, and then we hear we say, "Say we hear Ebu Megusui." Copies are civil engineer for. Omo bua konta ne diya sa adi. I mean, all our lives we are it's, we are permeated with science. In the science, in your dear, open to me at what time? Sir, in the obia service, science for the cancer obia, who treats him say a light thing. You are you are doing a disservice to Christianity. So, open to me in two science in China. Sir, it's a very powerful force. It will um, the culture. And now, religion is also a powerful. A woman said in some parts of the world, the religion died down. But up by to see a big problem here. And yes, I'm going to go. That's a fair and yeah, man, you're heating up. But the reason to a sir, yeah, man, me, no science, no religion. As I say, 
Yet me dream how one more relating in a say. They both make claims about knowledge. Patch of Adian Gusman, why? Now I picture under me here, could I say me who did jaw or moon me? Namas screen and asso. Okay. Omun yina make it, I say, legitimate claims. Legitimate knowledge claims. If they say claims, sir. Science make about knowledge, you know, and I name the end. Say, you legitimate and can you be bring your edge, Which I say, one say, Obi, a Russia, now Ukraine. No crowd, they get to a bit to say, yeah, I'm a couple parties and crophone in them. You know, summa to pay, you know, I'm on coordinates. Oh, ha, blow up at this time. Oh, deeper beyond him. I didn't be quite be raw. Who bet me I can't say where you're false? It works. And the only one name in the Bia, aye true, yeah, aye Juma. And the only one they make legitimate claims. And until it presents what we might call a philosophical challenge. Because if you are a thinker, there, so we will be out drinking near Mahua. You know, say we have a challenge on our hands. Why? Because some crofuem may no more making legitimate claims. Of course, um, Bible and our religion. In this case, we are restricted to Christianity. Knowledge claims your Christianity making. No, me here say me chiramu. This a beer. You haven't experienced it, but me. Obien who bet me a j and quadia may go a radius crystal, who bet me a gem film in some da. I know. I mean, if people don't know, that's not my business. Media, me nimia radit me free do what I may be I know the the claims about Bible here about salvation. I know it in my life to be true. Okay, till we are they are both making legit, but the problem they say. Sesa groups him in a science and religion. Omo make claims about knowledge and legitimate. Then we have a challenge because they make claims that sometimes clash. I told that the science they can. Any nia the Christians who can, who can be more, any year. How shall we resolve it? And by the way, science no, and the religion no, omo mi enu nyinawo different ways of reasoning to come to conclusions omo ba no. Omo nyinawo kwan omo faso a omo dwene a emu omo beka nyawo ka. In other words, they have reasoning strategies. For those of you who that might sound too too technical. There is a way to think. There is a strategy to think. Science does it differently from theology. And see, what is the scientific reasoning strategy? A quam ben a science for genia. A mu omu come to conclusions about knowledge. It seems to me say quite obvious say. The thing that distinguishes science from every other discipline is no? eh, what we call the scientific method. Say, a quania, okay, the scientific method. What is method? Method, it comes from Greek word to be hodos, chile, way. A, a way of thinking, a scientific way of thinking. What is this scientific way of thinking? What is this strategic way of science of first one until we come to conclusions? If I were in the online, or see the scientific method, a method of procedure that has characterized natural science since the 17th century, consisting in systematic observation, measurement, and experiment, and the formulation, testing, 
and modification of hypothesis. Hmm. Are we still alive? Obi o ha di edre aburu nsu bebere. Yes science for no. Said the omu yon se no ma fa sa kwen su a fi be 400 years ago. The omu yon se. Om sha di ha. Na omu sha omu sha di ni omu sha na haphazardly a systematic Om tu om bo as sha di e bi e de brebe tu hon. In fact, bi o sha di en 30 minutes. No as no fi na komesa hen one hour. A strategic, it was a, a, a systematic observation. Om kwa di ena hain. Na o susu susu ni ema o take measurements or gather data. No o kika ni ema bom. Ah, mi kwa di ena di wana wana e senti se mi diwe ko kan huwa na mi kwa ni be two hours ya. Se ni be si ayo. No o kika bom. No o ye experiments. Di o ye sa. I feel so. At the best, say the same thing at the end, yes, sir. As some work as a best, say the same thing, sir. The answer in the hypothesis, you know, what far do you be say? Say not the end, yeah. Now, first, I do know our science, you know, not what test you say. Say, say it to the end, the amazing experiment, my repeat, yeah. One of the things about the scientific method, the man, you're powerful, you say. A idea you can test it. So what you gonna have now? So who are you? Obiti Spain. Obi follow method, you know. Or test it. No one had the same result. Let's just say they are working here, no quarry. Inti a very interesting the the, the ability to test a niema and a madeni science. Now testing us and go here. Who can say ah? Basically saying the same thing as yes, I know. Now what what trick you got? No one modifying got. No formulating a new hypothesis. The science both are in an answer. Well, first I can so. Now one who said yet, we can we are saying you're right. Reality, I can say. The nature of reality. In that body, yes, so in your nature. But adi 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 e wo wi asi nyina na de ban ni sey na mra be ni chichir sa ani ma no ha che se enye ma atwa ye ho ahia yi ensuo enua owuo awo nsroma osu mawire sa ani ma nyina ye hu ni ye atwa ho ahia yi no why are they as they are? And then it is said yet, you know. Now, I'm rapping soon, you know, I'm almost sad. For example, you want to see, hey, my husband said, I'm the plant to be a big one. So, I'm going to go pine plant in this year. No, be a year. You didn't see a good one after about three weeks. Then, baby. Plant in the best answer. Sorry. Why? I didn't think that's what be a year. Okonya accident bi na bi o hwa se na na to fre ho a me atwe ne de ase ade mu if you say o mo atia se 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 o bi si ani mu akase ne o suban bi se eno a be sa wura fa ho asa kase ani mu why so they ask him i didn't think that sir why should the bone join why are the bone o adwene bi o de yes ha de na na pato mo ti de me kire no the science yi o nyina ne se my few minutes But over basis say yeah na. Okay. But you want to the children. So the goal of science, science both time a restricted to reality. Name it in Russia. They want to understand it so that they can maximize the advantage. Ni pa be to me nya. Every reality. So science seeks 
to build a theoretical image of reality and its web of laws. Science. But I don't know. Okay. Until quickly, you know, say, who follow scientific method now? This is how it goes. We have research. We have collected data. No, I forget to be hypothesis. Be just say, say this, say that. Sadly, it is say. No, I test the hypothesis. No, by conducting an experiment. No, I make an observation about the whole thing. No, no, analyzing the man. I feel a need here. I could present to one man at an academic conference. Now, PS in our gentleman, feel an air by a gentleman. And the person who is saying, "Mr. Science, for almost study reality, when so bad people are." You're paying for back cabbage that your hair. You see way you say, "You say, you 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 say, say, you 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 say, and that they are then topic in mind, and what can I say? Into a bit, a bit, a bit, a crystal knee. No, I say a scientist. Me person me nailing it down firmly say, So we better scientists, yeah, you will follow this method. If you will not follow this method, you are not a scientist. But don't you see, um, sir, the entire way here, no, you're quite anymore, a very clearer. It is what here they make. I make say science for almost here. Ha! In Sio, Obi and Nanya Buo, almost here. Ha! And they pick up information, data. Whether that's from the one when in the area, and that's from the microscope, and any technology be a developed instrument to be able to make measurements. No, a reality. Now this is very important. You see. Scientists, you know, they get their data and not their information. Yeah, we just draw conclusions you know, from what we call sensory perception. Sensory perception, should I say? A kind of fascinating thing, say. What the insaco can? My senses. Your senses, you say. Hey, me can't say that. I'm saying the Bible can't hold. Aha. Okay. At least five of the eight, right? Do I need your Eyes? Yes. Then no smell. Taste. Touch. But the way important. Mr. Sudia said, science you may DNA say they look at reality. Through these senses. To make the knowledge claims that I'm making up. But I want to say, uh, very important. Science, a uh, case, meaning say, say that the entire, the entire work as I say, we used to say senses in, after body behind, I formulate the hypothesis be, I'm a be a contest, I'm a do a kind of be a muntu. Science, we come in this year, just to say, it is. True. So, science begins by presupposing. My camera focus here. Science begins by assuming. Pacho until or assuming without proof. That is the nature of. Presuppositions. What assume say? And you may real are only the things that can be ascertained through the senses. I want to ask you. Obi inchere masi adi anam kansi si e. Asemben anam kain. Ana be. Obi repeated anam kain. On Chelsea, be an American, be Bibasa. Rich, what try? 
se wona oye abodemu ehwemu no se ansa na wo mbaji bibi atumu no omo e wa adwin bi se the priest of Jesus in the that is right omo adwin bi se ansa na bibi ye beji bibi atumu no e wo se eniema ti se eniema numu a wo kan ho asemi ni nyina abem ye de ensa kan e be yi ye hwi a ye te bibi eh eh ni taste no na yi no ni nyina ka bo me ye e for me we say eye no kure ansa na o ma dia tun e dia ye djuma kana se se me no wa se si e me ka se hello anjoa i to say yo wow na nkwara no e what would you think why why Talk, why? Momo, why the Which means say, science actually has played a trick on all of us, whether we know it or not, to believe in the scientific method. Who told you, say, I'm not talking to my wife? Because you are not seeing my wife up there. I'm telling you, I see her. He's, she's there. I'm talking to her. Aha. But they're making a very fundamental point with science. That which we cannot see or smell or hear or touch is not real. So, in fact, follow it further. So, what we say is they presume a certain ontology. Ontology word can see actually being things that are see a and a and then the ontology. Scientists begin by presuming a certain ontology that is naturalistic. So when you mean when you want to mean test, you mean spell it. It is not true. So you see why gradually, you know, the relationship between science and religion is going to be more of a duel rather than a duet. But we have established that in our own lives, science makes very good legitimate knowledge claims. Now, when we can also how are you going to defend it? Okay. Theology and our religion. How what is what is the original the actual science or reasoning strategy? Theology is a reasoning strategy in a sense. I say, sir, theology reasons reasoning strategy, what we call the theological method. The other one was scientific method. We yeah, theological method. And also say quine be a fast one. You come to conclusions, sir. You come to your collected data. To say science, you know, uh, collected data. Data no are collecting in the free. So but theology for no you will never be brave, but we are very popular with um, other branches of Christianity. What they call the quadrilateral method. Quadri, quadrilater, quadru, uh, for one, for the way I whistle in the flash here, but a very popular among Methodists, and as I say, I spread it to the evangelical field. You know. But we almost say, so we we'll we'll be come to a conclusion, yeah, yeah, theological, consult the Bible, science, tradition, culture. Papa, be a million, monsieur, and one day, the immature of meditation, or say, or not the quadrilateral, no, it is a cunier si hui. A crubia and chancro. We crubia free macunana tape. No munina and yet is a platform. Which means uh, for those people, their method, you know, they they don't prioritize any one of these above the other. Yen dear, we still hold on to what we call the solar scriptura principle, the Bible and the Bible alone. 
You cut the Bible and the Bible alone. One, but you can say the Bible and the Bible only. What we mean by solar scripture, and say you can consult science, you can consult culture, you can consult tradition. But at the end of the day, the Bible controls, overrides, or norms any of these other sources of information and our data. But what is the certainty? Say, yes, it's such an album. Near my Bible, not control my, but Taya, a day theology, a day a ticket religion. I say, our goal is to understand. God. You can't God, of course. Who understand the God that we are talking about God, who He is, His creation, His attributes. Religion, Okay. But religion, no. Said they are described wrong reasoning strategies and the science reasoning strategies, no. A challenge because of the data, no. One more use of the jargon. Now they are trusting me, you know. But that's why it's so many of me are doing. See, here they turn on science, you know. So they match it. They use sensory data exclusively. Religion uses revealed data primarily. The goal of science. To construct different a cosmology, cosmo logos, cosmos a dream, right? Logos a reasoning, cosmology. They construct a world view, a way out. The we are seeing on both time. Now, now, yeah, because you said, what more data? No, a yes, sensory, no. Smell, touch, see, hear, any other thing, you know. Often, God is excluded. Why? You can't see God. You can't touch God. At least not if you are using the scientific method. Because churches will be able to say, and I do in Jamaica and Chirene say, what's in Jamaica and They are talking about audible here. What? To one day, one day, they have a different case. Theology constructs a worldview inclusive of God and the supernatural. The end, so we can say, I'm most likely going to believe. If you say, we believe that it happens, you can say, I'm going to 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 say, I'm going and to back to elder wish, you know, how do we relate? How do we uh, navigate sad way you know? Um, me person me can say, one way say bre, a genius sad problem. You may bro how you know that. You know that I'm going to buy a. Eh, for my bank. Eh, you know. But one way say bre, genius sad you know. One way say bre, a say say you know. About side issue, yeah, I can't want to see me. And never been. It's important. There one more can say. Yeah, I'm fancy. Say me. May control any theological paper. Yeah, may address side issue. Yeah. And you man, you may go. Man, yeah, yeah. Oh no, oh, feel him. Oh, no, turn turn. Oh, no, you can. But I want to say, make an answer. Say be those who know. I been for an answer. Who enter into this debate? These are five things you should assume. To say you are not welcome to the table. One, picking, people now reject what we call reductionism. Reductionism is saying, science for someone can say, when you are so anti, yeah, 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 Wait a minute. You need to be a postmodernism and a disadvantage number. People are beginning to reject that crude naturalism. And they are now saying, say, science is a Quran. There is a hermeneutical dimension. 
Sans kura se omo so omo interpretation omo asumu ne ma bi nti en ka se ye sans de ye de objective ye de bi bia ye objective and just objective a christian is down christopher na ye subject no 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 and that de obi ati asese both signs and religion bring with us to table with assumptions good news two a pervasive understanding of the evolutionary universe as compatible with the Christian doctrine of creation. Who can say? Moses say? Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. Evolution, no problem. what they are saying is say, if you are going to be partaking in this kind of discussion, you must presume that. Number three, because of Yanuntino. There is a revival of a theology of nature. Of course, so I can evolution we have Say you call nature, you can derive truth from nature and the Bible uh, and say it didn't Number four, theology and science both share a mutual quest for intelligibility. True. Theology and science in one person may be a say. The fifth one say. How do we do an ongoing reflection on how physical processes might be open to accommodate the acts of both human and divine agencies? It is a sanity, a better yet enough for quite be so. See, I perceive the scientific processes as here. A bit me a mark wine, I may be a miracle, and I may be a bit of a bit of a discussion in the hour. Okay, where your general background to the MPSM here, a free health corner. I'm going to be specific. Let us then just take one area of science. And I know how this problem is working. And actually, it is the one area that I think for Adventists, the concern here by cosmology. Um, Eric, I'm going to chemistry. I'm going to have a problem with my own. I'm going to have a problem with my own. chemistry. I don't have a problem with God. What do you have? My friends say, scale a table. No? Now, periodic table. Now, the, 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 the, now, 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 the, 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 <laughs> from the fifth century to the fifteenth century, no, Jew four, a Christo four, and Kremu four, no Bia did say a real way this universe had a beginning. The ka cosmology, yeah, Jin. The universe and the cosmos. Baby, I'm passing a tragedy city. How did it begin? How will it end? We see an area, young Christopher, teacher Adventist, they're interested in power. Send a universe in France, yeah. Now send a very quick way. Unfortunately, so our area, young, so, and a science, and a Christians, your problem. Yeah, and from the 5th century to 15th century, there, no, be a name set. This universe had a beginning. Who named Aristotle, a Greek philosopher? Western world, who knew a cherry power on some chromophone who first. Think chromophone who Aristotle, no, be our sheer Greek philosophy beyond a one cardinal principle say matter is eternal. Sana Aristotle, Plato, Parmenides, Omina, Domo can say, I am matter, I eternal. It has no beginning, it has no end. Nan kamufu kuhuna restotel. 
and on the back Christian West, Latin West. A horse in a Christian smoke also. Immediately there was a problem. And said a Catholic church in Sabre and Omnan said, Oh, a duo muquiba. Omu fre cancel immediately. No, 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 no. You see, Sudia as a doctrine say this universe had a beginning in time. Period. Now, Sabre, no. The Catholic Church, you know, the idea is you are not dressed up. This is all about what happens to you. And to Uber Casa, are you careful? I'm sorry, not Casa. That's the end. Is it? Enter Newton. Papa, we did not cross him. Obi say, and God said, "Let there be Newton," and there was light. And of course, I'm passing a quota. I'm saying, "Nipa pe wuyi anza ni yewo no." Nipa ame so wami peno. Nipa dunu komo obi ni dunu ko school. Nipa ame so wanya school no. It's an amazing story, this man. And in the name of Yeye Intimi in Kanasem. Okay, can't be brainy. Okay, I'm sorry to say, there is a definite beginning period. Now Newton so started so early. I'm saying gravity need a more kind. Yes, no, to be able to say, yeah, na apple be tea and a bone to say, boom. Obi Oha can say, stupid apple. Hmm. Hey, then apple no tea and an kosro. Never bomb me to this war. A man I this year. Anyway, he spoke about gravity, about gravity, about him. But I did about kosro, I will come up and say, yes. This issue said, universe in what beginning and answer what end. No, it is true, and it's also not completely true. Or oh, see, yet yeah, for the absolute of space and time, uh, any beginning, any end. Now, more open the contents. Yeah, what space? Netanya, it had a beginning. I I I I If you new thing, I mean, can we? Sir, from Pastor the Elder, can be a scientist or Adventist? Who be also a philosopher? They can't just say Sir, from new thing. Those giants, ni na ano. Who come background duma? There was spiritualism in their background. No, I'm the only one. Oh, yes, science, yeah. No, I fact, science, church, church. A do men down, I could say on the trust and demo. No, I fast sorry, Chashi. To anyhow. Or better not on demo, Bishop Nuki can open the hour, no, anyhow. O Pierre Qua. No, any juma. And the Newton one and the ho. And what developed several theories. Yeah, back when it's a universal law of gravitation. So, I law of gravitation. One bit me a boy and sons for a man. What's in it? Newton was a gravitation in the air. Uh, yes, uh huh. Was it a force? We are a pull something. Would you say everything? A scientist, very careful. At least on planet Earth, maybe of course it will be all right. But the issue, no, they say, what Newton was saying, they say, body be a one mass, new way to one mass, attract any other body. It's a sea, no, me burn rich, me bra, although we don't feel it, no, me no, no, dear, you, Charlie, your friends, eh, Kima, me, me, rich, no, oh, pull me, miss me, pull me, by any, you know, I, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, I may catch you. I had the moon who's had the end, but America, the first time Philly's had the end, you'll be a mobile car. So, who caught highways? Maybe that's a semi sacassi and a panel. So, who to cack it to a man? Now, the soul this PDR, who wants it? A chum, a chum, a bang. At the little caracan, you feel it. Okay, to what Newton is saying is that 
Bibia won masi biana. A chin yonko. Unfortunately, in this tug of war between Mimini Asasi. Assassin is so big, say. Nipu no so so much say wa when the battle. And then I'm gonna hold you. Nyasa send on a word and say, come out, who you could have come, baby. I'm a person contents to say, yeah, I feel I'm a coffee fa a ye a chimota honey abbey. Come see, hey, mama, me bow. No, who you how nice. Unfortunately, as I said, I win a battle. That's what he was saying. It was a, a pool, a force. When Timmy and Chiren said that force in the free, and actually, they know Susuni said force, and there is an innate power. I said, BBA can't in it, there be a tip mass in and a pool is any pan. Then comes. Einstein. Now, a Todana, and she had the association. Bones of science discoveries in the urban say, Oh, we can't we ain't a giddy. Oh, you're trouble. Now, call me a giddy, you're trouble. The car pass, yes, son. The car bar, you don't trust a nipper, dear. You want quiet, and who named fast will be any day over him. Appendix. I feel the doctor, someone sent this idea. Yes, son. This is a science here. No one can be too well known. If I could be Thomas Kuhn or say scientific revolution, so I try to book me or try how I said it will happen. Okay. And if you be too well known, no one can come and nice can come. So you too well known. Comes Einstein. No publishing a bit or say special relativity. But basically, the whole kind and I'm say yes, there is there is a pool be going on. And the answer there be a open one be a no. And yet, absolute, and yet, relative. And or say special relative there, should I say, space, the time, and yet, inextricably woven. I can't be say, won't me in case, one minute will have, and the same one minute will have. You can say that duration, in fact, I'm going to say, so be running faster, if it's a clock, no be running faster. Now, all run fast, Jen, what would you know? With sense of time, no, are you slower? I said, Nima, you know, you're related, and you're simple, sir. But at that point, in the answer, no, one is specific relativity, no, no, one acknowledge the issue of gravity. One firm, no, until one fair, no, special theory of relativity, no. Ten years later, and we'll publish another one, theory of general. Relativity. Then you do kind of say, mm, Newton, thank you. Are there any pool? Any pool? What happens in this set? Massive objects in a Nema Cassia Cassia Bosome assassin in Yeme Warriors. What they do in this set? Or see. They this okay into your fancy maybe you know so person who will be a me according to science you know you must be concerned with the three coordinates so uh, yeah, length height breadth and time or see a friend your friend space time so now be defined baby you know or see baby we are sibiano you can define it by sa coordinates in space time but what really happens in this Semi mijina hai massive object ibi ba me swa it warps it distorts my time my space time configuration na sa warping na se I said that me pese me piano se I no na wo si e fre no gravity no but really e ya warping na e koso no the best one describe sa dia ni se mo trampoline. A dear Bianni and Flats and Uncle Aku Rani, dear group is on Sadia. Ha. Would you have fun say? Would the tennis balls set trampoline and a trick? Nanka, the tennis balls be at the two outer ring in a bedding. They'll stay there, Uniza. And Jerry, because at that tennis ball in the moon shed and yet do, sa say. Would it to 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 sa? Obetra. And all of a sudden, so far, 
a massive ball of steel. Ebe two adi anything fi adi bayo. Bonsa, ball be de. Hmm. Ebe two anything fi home. So what? Or can we generate even in say the air cushion? Any pools are, but a warping a massive object, you know, a distort to other objects, you know, and a friend gravity. You, know. you see where this is going because, um, I will explain that. I mean, pharmacy say, but out of this, in per complications, me person me simplify and take it from me, say, a hey, true. Out of such studies about relativity, you know, one of the key implications of any notion of one friend expanding universe. It is a reasonal to say in a quan echo, quan expandable, quan expandable. And no the idea of big bang, no bang, send will be at it. Big bang, see, there was a point in time, yeah, there was a huge explosion. And then you to go with him. Necro. Then you manacro. Necro. Then you manacro. If we are saying, I say, creation is that's what we are. Necro. So, the moment take time, I'm a specific character. Point in time, no, a big bang. You see, no. I'm saying, I'm friend. Singularity. I'm a definition. Ho. A time in the history of the universe when all matter was constrained to an extremely tiny space. A space of infinite density and temperature. It contained all the mass of the universe. A hot, dense ball about the size of a human head. What is the scientific method? That we see. Have they seen that ball? How did they come to this conclusion? Because, as you will see, Einstein came up with all sorts of scientific equations. I want to say, we must solve equations to prove that this is true. And the I want to say, universe here, what you know? And your fragments of an explosion still flying in the universe. That is what science believes. This is how it goes. The universe started out very hot and has been cooling over ever since. Because I didn't it it was intensely hot. Boom! Hot. To say a close idea, air calling an arm, Nejo Nejo. When the temperature reaches a certain threshold, underline the word threshold, new or a freezing out take place. A blow sound or conscientious arm was it said a curua could do baby now a freezing. Each freezing out involves the appearance of new forms of matter. And energy. The baby is cool, no? Maybe a planet Earth, haba. And I say, Mercury, haba. At the very hot beginning, there were no molecules or atoms. On say, the way they calculate, you know, before the Big Bang, you know, I did not intense matter. No, I say, you know, was it had some isotropic word? I'm using no. Isotropic quality and a homogeneity. There is no variety in whatever it was. The objects of nature, as well as the laws governing them, were gradually produced. They put together the laws. There was an expansion and cooling after the Big Bang cooling matter collected into galaxies and smaller planets like Earth. Until our friend Ted Peter will say, we on Earth today are still riding on a piece of sharp nail out and away from the point of initial explosion. 
But where are we going? What does the future hold? Ted Peters. Until one more assume we say big bang for no science for no involving cosmology, because cosmology in Kwa, a real symphony, and say, in a real one, some other kind. Almost did he say the universe is open. But I'm saying, I didn't know Kulu of a Kulu, but Kulu for a Kulu is saying two scenarios how this is going to end. So you open the universe, dear. There is going to be an intense cold where everything chills out and it's finished. But say a closed universe, dear. Don't cut anything for your back entropy. You might be break it down. Then there will be big crunch. There will be an end. Whichever way, open or closed, there will be a crunch. There will be an end. But here is what I'm saying. Ma catch them young could be say me. Me kwa brand onko. Da meji evolution ye dien. That very day I surrender my ministerial license and I cease to be a Christian. It is that important. A third day you be can say. Ah, big bang Roman him say creation. No, no, ah. The Big Bang theory is not equivalent to the doctrine of creation. Nti pasa, elder, can somebody be a Christian and be a scientist? If you are a Christian scientist and you go along with this Big Bang theory, which you should, because that's where the consensus is at, it's hard for me. And you see how people are trying to do this, bringing this to equate it to the doctrine of creation. The entire anti-mania doctrine of creation is a before the big bang, and I'm saying the end of the whole. The big bang doesn't tell us Sabon in the free. Christian doctrine here. It tells us how things began. The big bang theory does not tell us how things began because they cannot tell us sir born if you hear the bible second so what's the big bang theory in india because one see a bomb comes on and then you're an evil uncle yes sir and now the laws of nature so cool which is there then you must also believe in evolution And it is not possible. Summary of the Big Bang uh, cosmology. History of the universe is a history of evolution. Development of complex structures out of a simple element in accordance with built-in principles of interaction, the laws of physics. On planet Earth, the process of evolution continues. And she said, universe, you know, how it went. On planet Earth, the process of evolution continued as simple atoms of carbon, hydrogen, oxygen and other elements built up and developed into the millions of life forms. It is impossible for cosmologists to scientifically tell us how the world began. Why? Because all proper science, I'm talking about physical sciences, must touch See, smell, feel. For them to be able to give us a theory of origins, they must have been there to observe God. Scientifically. Otherwise, it is not science anymore. And unfortunately, that's what has happened. Semu follow. Sad discussion, yeah. US and Croform talk about intelligent design. That's how it has the evolutionary campaign has become like a cult. You don't belong to it. Turn your crown here. Okay. But the fact that cosmology might not be able to explain that event doesn't mean I didn't okay. But what you are here. The fact of science for Muntimin Chiremuse, 
Bow no free hand and buy and a crystal for the ones that It doesn't mean say ain't to me happen. So, who can say ain't to me happen? You are only saying that because of your presuppositions. But what you say? And I'm near my was human tea. Nothing to me, Massa. Tell me, yeah, me now. Me, Miss Minimi, you're in the Casas Ray. Must you enter Massa as of our bottom? Ah, now what you did in open suppositions is such as hold on, sack and dear, what touch at it. Didn't ask me to be one made it. So just I did go, ah, hey, say we are CBB or higher with your third eye, and I said, You are, but me, I did is a mini made a Casamba. It's all a matter of worldview. You change your worldview, it is possible. So the limits of scientific rationality, in other words, the senior science for quantum fast greening, a draw conclusions, you know, it points to a deeper religious mystery. And actually, some people have seen it. I call we one and picture pen. We wumba. Stephen Hawking. One and one picture pen. But what describe no here? Who knows what here? Not a wheelchair. I said, and I said, Oh, Huna. And I asked what need to say, why you so, but I found him. Aha, and so I'm saying, I'm a home breaker, crazy. Actually, oh, the throne of Einstein. He is the throne in Einstein. Because they are so smart. On Kasao, on Yaki, on Tibikram, Fape, Adia Kranj, and Muntro, nothing. No, Tiwich and Musa. No, Fakwam is not a genuine free in Trimubano. Or Tinasi and Uhunze. Or say, Se Uji Big Bang, Nidia. Because, okay, I say, ye push it back, ye push it back. Who push it back? I know I'll be through Big Bang. Was you be our intelligent crab in a so be say, okay, I'll be through boundary now. What is beyond the boundary? Was you want to be honest? You must ask that question. No, afraid that question, no, the God question. If you say, if there is a boundary, there must be something beyond the boundary, of course, so sad, you know. In the one on the bottom, and say, he is because Kayo Einstein, um, general relativity, near the no. And the two are so the big bang and obey. And to say obey us, I didn't know. Then he must overthrow Einstein. Exactly what he's doing. Exactly what he's doing. And he seems to have succeeded. Minya win is our Friedman Lemaitre Robertson or metric, you know. Problem no soon. The entire this I didn't was a problem. Is to say Einstein no create equations. Serious equations are some profound name. I saw those equations now. I'm a pussy and pack. There was the big bang because almost saw the equation now. The, the point and say there was a point like that, but let's not worry about that. But the Amma Hawking, I can't answer what you which I'm more. The Amma Hawk saw city and a new field in science, a friend of quantum theory because. Or say, Woo Einstein, or say, okay, you're the infant free, eh? Newton, force, ne pulling your man. I said, I'll be a year, actually, a year. A year warping, be a distortion, be as a piadium. Now, my friend, gravity. But quantum theory, maybe wonderful. Quantum theory, no. Nia HS, a say, yeah, science forms, so yeah, to just an etienne, say. Kwasi kono jina. Ye ye kwa school no. Be kwa ye chere ye physics no. Ni ye kan se light e made of what? Rays. Ni ye chro ye no. E no biye ni wa wa ye physics ha. Wa be kan sa ase mnu biyo. Ni ye omu hunu ni se. At the end, I need to say light rays, no. And now you can see or a ray, or you know, a dark particle. When normal friend, 
a law be say it's indeterminable. Won't mean determinate the end. For how much they say a probability in America say it is an ascent. And what's now Einstein will say. Me, 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 I said, me, me must, and I'm the warp at the end, sir. So, who can say you must have assumed the set? Penny matter, and you're fixed, yes, sir. Say you're fixed that. Won't you mean one on Cosa? And now, one minute as well, sir. I'm per quantum theory and no correct. And say, no correct, you're not Einstein. What the end one? Where is the matter in a way for it to be pushed? When today it is this, tomorrow it is this. To where we are, gradually, Hawking and his folk are dethroning Einstein. Do I say? After 250 years of Newton comes Einstein. Instead of a pool, Einstein saw gravity as the result of a curved space. He said that all objects in the universe is a smooth four dimension called Einstein. Massive objects such as the sun warp the space around them. And so Earth's orbit is simply the result of the planet following its course. Then Einstein, but Hawking, I say, I say Hawking and us are now looking to what they call quantum gravity. Because uh, Newton, what kind of gravity? Okay. These people are talking about quantum gravity gravity this avoids a boundary point so with that you know, Hawkins overcome the God's question here are questions that will never go away uh, science you know yeah, the idea we see in eye so the thing is okay let's assume big bang true philosophers will question me why does our universe exist? I mean, it is equally plausible, say. There should be no universe. Philosophically, why is there something and not nothing? A question that philosophers can ask themselves. A mystery. Why should the universe exist? Laws, no, and physics, they can say, Einstein can say, to every... Uh, Action and there is a equal personal equal reaction. Where is that law coming from? How did the, the baby in your womb after I say egg in the initial no say me me Johnny Akoha now me could do her mom on your money saying yeah 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 you understand what I'm saying how did those laws come about Nasa loss no are they absolute or can they be changed? No book be nan come de baba me badami. Wouldn't you say Kaneno Mua Muya Master near where Euclidean geometry mwa? Geometry is as a son. I'm an crofoa come up with new math and it also works. Euclidean geometry, no, and on that planes start here, planes perform start on the fly, and then with Einstein, no, and then Euclidean geometry, bio. and so Euclidean geometry, no, on the fly, he could do the Quran, so I'm cause my why are these things absolute? Now, the young one said, So, who are the test of science for the mathematician? Oh, the, the equation is so beautiful. Come on, equation beautiful. Who be who so much? You don't want to say you're beautiful. How is it possible? Say a team represents an image you know, with complex equations. What was it? It's going to quadratic equations. Quadratic equations. They have humongous equations. Why is that possible? Me person me can say. So be a Christian scientist. Go ahead. Follow all these rules. But notice that the very nature of your research you know, is limited. It is limited. Paul Davis, once we come home, Stephen Hawking, and then grow one billion, or say, the search for a closed logical system that provides a complete and self consistent explanation for everything is doomed to failure. 
Wajatu. Is there a route to knowledge, even ultimate knowledge, that lies outside of the road of rational scientific inquiry and logical reasoning? Many people claim there is. What is it? Mysticism. Oh, Paul, cast of God and Christianity. Just why not give Christianity all my credit that and it's how they are mysticism. Mysticism is not yeah, he doesn't mean you are not Or just a hide the mysticism. We have very nice Christians who, for whatever reason, started studying science. They are soaked in this. They have their PhDs in science. They are not going to be able to throw this thing out. Yet they love the Lord. What do they do? They are tweaking the beginning story. And I'm telling you, the way I make country, almost all theologians of respect, this is what they are doing. This is what they say. Creation story now, Elder Kamal say. The theological intent of the Genesis creation story is to underline the dependence of an intelligible and contingent universe on a creator and not necessarily to specify a first moment in time. Oh, by the way, South Foreign United as yes, South Story no, and your history. Said the Minu Mien Yajidino, and your history. And fans and was it story in Nana Moses Patra and say, and never what we are seeing in a way we are in a chess. One more dying or bad, ye be. Nanya no more say, and I didn't say, or pursue a chiller say, and what brep or tea be, and then I'm a bad dear, no cassa we are bra, and no cassa we bra, yes, sir. The more more faster in the sun, no more you're too naive. Sana, a beam form was your theology, a queen, you know, Sana, I say, oh, gee. Papa, we were all caught. Philosophy of science, near that, you are better than Arthur Peacock. Or see, new scientific perspectives require a reinterpretation of the classical version of creation to mean the cosmos which is sustained and held in being by God is a cosmos which has always been in process of producing new emergent forms of matter. Or says, I see a Timmy Church, a Genesis story, and I say, Mary, I say, Chess and Nemo Gusua, a own expanding universe, and Nemo Gusua, Chess, and Nemo Sakrakwa, and Fa Genesis story, not Trasa. It is our uncle of when you are from what pen, theistic evolutionists. Basically, the Omo can say, soon as we can so say evolution, they are yet. Do I just say I am in an evolution so ne ba di? Say that kambu. Or see if the universe is one of true becoming with the future not yet known. This is very serious and existing. And if God knows that world in its temporality, when you have a fact, like I say, the person will change it. Okay. Once they are at a peak or kind, or see if we are some kind of near coso, and the name of a friend neighbor. Now, to say, say I am a tear dear. Next say, I am so so. It seems to imply that God cannot yet know the future. Now, see, we can say God cannot know the future. Be out to much. Hey, I'm going to send back. I can say, "I'm so nim free." Now you can see. How can you say that? What's it? But this is no imperfection in the divine nature. My amu insho. I say no matter. I'm going to make sure. For the future is not yet there to be known. If you say, so our future, and anyone here who, it is something I mean to me, who is our future now? I don't know man how we're Christian. It is not there to be known. I don't know why you who, and you who. Involved in the act of creation, in the letting be of the truly other, is not only a kenosis, a humbrasia, a mebre, and wasia. But also a kenosis of divine knowledge. Now, me and Kasa Tinahomaso, you'll be to me. 
Paul King Hong. Oh, no bad, yeah. Bright, bright. This man, Paul King Hong. All the time. What does the Bible say? Isaiah 46, 9 to 10. God declares the end from the beginning. But if any of you is tempted to believe in theistic evolution, good luck. Genesis 1 3 should be read as poetry and allegory and not as a historical narrative. Creation was brought into being in a relatively formless state. But brimming with awesome potentialities for you. Bro, fuck, I said, don't you. Okay. Brimming with awesome potentialities for achieving a rich diversity of forms in the course of time. Adam and Eve would not necessarily be envisioned as the first human beings, but would be elect individuals drawn out of the human population and given a particular representative role in sacred space. John Walton. You see why homosexuality and these things are gaining grounds? Because one Let's go to the creation story. What kind language The way I describe it, my own say, where your bar, your trade, you know, or describing the whole one. But he's telling you, Adam and Eve are not necessarily like that. We just pick those names to represent human beings. We just pick those names to represent human beings. So your argument said, it's destroyed. Therefore, homosexuality is a possibility. They go through the, all these discussions in the argument. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Adventist. How would you go about reconciling science and religion? Here is the way to go. You begin with the presupposition of the Bible. Said the Bible contains historical records. I cannot emphasize this enough. Said the Bible must make an area historical. You see, be a historical nature. Say, abako sem, abako sem. A buy and the echo and one seven the echo. Me no me any anti anti Adventist and say the Bible no come with Genesis say ya abba ko sem a historical record. And na sa abba ko sem no omo e tro e no. Bra omo tro no wakano wa Timothy and the Peter say nyame hum hum and the ko e di omo suma do omo tro and e accurate. Maybe in the new scientists, you must accept this. And to your TSS, seven day creation, no, are you literal? Now, women in the new episode are scientists, and it's all my sad year way. They can form a worldview. Now, we are, bro, we apply scientific method. To my exams, you know, Papa, we are not, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I faith and science in America, GRI for you know, Michelle. Papa friend at a Chadwick. And now, Omni Omar is almost steady and say geology. Oh, you know, the geology no more. You say, okay, science for cosmology, you know, the big bang. Yeah, a Volvo. They have no room for biblical story of the flood. No room. But some of the geologists, we know, Om Philly said. See, there was a flood. We can then say, say, then the biblical story must be true. So, what are here? See, that's what they are doing. Into what we call a Grand Canyon, a Arizona. But what Grand Canyon? What? Omo sandstone lay a friend tapit tapit sandstone. 
or say the, the lowest Pelozoic, no, a hono mukoi. Now, now standard idea, I want to say, formation of our rock, uh, the result of sand accumulating very slowly, just in an offshore shallow ocean. Sand will be high. Now, shadow is going to believe in the flood. No one says, oh, is it possible, say? And then I'm okay, say, uh, accumulating slowly, you know. It could rather have been rather fast. The biblical, I do not want to presuppose unity. Now, they were saying so. No, they approach it. Until his presupposition, a Christian, allowed him to ask questions that the non Christian geologists were not asking. And to a corner, also, he saw evidence. Said the position, no, really, he saw evidence. Said it was fast. Like I said, oh, yes, I didn't know. And I was sitting here and saw presenting people. Now, I chat with co presenting people. No? Or present paper and conform and formulate a theory and say it was slow and rapid. No? They were there. In the archad presenting, or presenting, you know, presenting, I didn't in area, you know, after meeting. Now, I'm conforming the old theory about what I say. Listen, why did you see this evidence that the rest of us did not see? Wait me, Yano. Because he allowed his Christian presuppositions to influence his scientific work. Because the whole says science, and there's a hermeneutical dimension to science, and the objective said, That's one example. We see a similar example. We see Papa Nyanom in an NAS Hegeman. Omko study whales or oh, Peru. Large area now whales. Fossilized whales. See, I can fossil among my crow. I told that, and one be who are not woman, I could share rock, we are not rock, not pressing that. I preserve one in the form of a petrified, in the form of a rock. And I'm going to study whales, you know. But the whales are so perfectly preserved. And now, and crow for say, again, because they don't believe in catastrophe like the flood, you know. It must have taken a long time. And I don't say, no way. It's not possible. Say, whales know who you know. for thousand years a minute, thousand years a foot, and then I didn't buy accumulated sir. It must have been rapid, because what they saw and they said, send the whales who in the ocean floor. It takes a short time, man. The other creatures in the sea have food. If and this are not, why would you presuppose that it takes a long time to waste that preserve so much? I'm just going to present to people and say, That's what I'm It makes sense. Why? They had a Christian worldview that informed their scientific research. And it is not going to be easy if you want to be a Christian and be a scientist. You can be, but let your presuppositions inform your work. And you are probably going to come up with things that will shock the scientific world. That is, when one say, I had a religion and not just science. Religion that it pushes science in a certain direction. But I just wanted to throw in this one too. But I think there are instances of so science is also a pushy religion in a certain direction. Say you know in the geologic column, the idea be abstract. No, put in kita say, I'm a shell rocks. No, I'm going study study. No, my put a bit try. You say, the lowest are there. No, Cambrian. No, about pre-Cambrian. No, about we or to the 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 Well, why is this a problem? Because one day ti we are saying, let's say a dia dene di four point six billion years. And so you are talking kind of about you know if you are you say about Adam and Adam be we we and Adam we we now to 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 the earliest you can get six thousand seven thousand ten thousand years. I don't know if you see how did it four point six billion huge crash. 
So it brings us back to read Genesis 1. 1 to 3 million. If you say, we have known that science for now, they come up with some knowledge that tends to be true. If you grant the possibility, say, the home equipment to catch up, the, the, the rocks may be like 4.6 billion years old. Let's assume it is true. How shall we read Genesis? In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. The earth was formless and void, and darkness was over the surface of the deep, and the Spirit of God was moving over the surface of the waters. Three. Then God said, Okay. Then God said, Can you see, sir? It seems, but when all I'm saying is, sir, geologists near the normal. A pushy end to look at the text a little bit more closely. In the beginning, God created. It was tohu bohu, formless and void, unformed, unfilled. Then, can you see there was something? Then God, okay. How should we now interpret this? There are all kinds of ways that are to be interpreted. Adventism, there were two approaches. The idea said there was something before God created. No Adventist will believe that. Okay? Creation was the beginning of everything. But how should we read this text? Um, Dr. Davidson proposed having Matro. I see. So follow thought in Genesis 1 to 2. Here's how it goes. God is before all creation. Clear from verse 1. There is an absolute beginning of time. God creates the heavens and the earth, verse 1. But they seem to be different from how it was at that time from how it is now. They are unformed and unfilled. So God created it. It was not formed. It was not filled. Hebrew four words in Tohu Bohun Then on the first day or the seventh day, God begins to form and fill the Tohu and Bohu. That is from verse 3 following. The forming and filling creative activity of God is accomplished in six successive days. At the end of creation week, the heavens and the earth are finally finished. What God began in verse 1 is now completed. God rests on the seventh day, blessing and sanctifying it as a memorial of creation. Now, some of you can hear, they can say, God created this one. What he created was unformed and unfilled. Verse 2. Then God said, let there be light. Beginning of creation. The question is, between the creation of the unformed and unfilled, how long was it? Then God, how long was that? I can't hear from I didn't mean it all. But I can't hear from no gap theory. But basically what he's saying is saying, it is possible, say, when God created the unformed, unfilled, you know, it had the appearance of old age. And then God filled it. Indeed, that unformed, unfilled it could be part of the creation week. But even though it was created so soon, I mean, who said the young can cry? And then, who had the idea? 
yam fa to say adam ni if nya me bo adam no ya o de ni jira ho say no adim fi se o ho na adam adim fi se we do one day and yeah, Adam is so no you. Obi, I will be one day. Now, check out who will be as we me. Boom, 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 boom. I'm going to I'm going to say. 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 I'm going to his chronological age. So, so I'm not here. Dear, let's say I'm so so. On any possible, I'm a boy. Adam said, "Obey to me and bow rocks." No, before Obey fell in. No, say the rocks will have a very long age. It's not possible. It's possible. Advent is to be believers. Sir, any a friend. No gap theory. A being so so believers say. And if we went for the passive gap, Yamipo had been unformed and filled. The Holy Spirit was hovering over the waters, as if like protecting it until God is ready to do the filling. That could have taken a long time. How long? We don't know. But what Advent is now, almost to propound so to the idea of Musu Diana say, men can say, during that time, no one in your main if that was the case, there was any life. Life as we know it began with the seven day creation. That's what I said, passive gap. There was no active thing going on. The Holy Spirit was breathing over the waters. And to all I'm saying is that because of geology, no age is missing. You know, theologians are being nudged to think a little bit more clearly. When I am seeing the basic here, yeah, way, way uh, too much. To the person make an science works with a certain method. The Obi Hunun Kwan a real. Then Einstein, New, Newton, Nomnia, they, they keep going, going. The only copy asked, oh, one will be able to be the ego. It is not a final thing that science is doing. Science is always in progress. We believe, say, the divine, the supernatural is real. We depend on scripture. And when science reveals the beer, a boy and Tiasia, we go along with it. But we have the solar scriptura where the Bible. Controls every data a day by day. No, me just say, so we are scientists, so we are Christian now. So we are science. Give yourself that preserve of humility. Say, my knowledge is limited. Nya ni edi ni huno di ansa kandi an kambi onkwa ne ye real. Because ye dima obi biya ra me catch ra brofun se he me catch ra mo. Obi e ni America ha me obi timi anji. Me giddy a cram on your mere freemen. As the children say, Me free and toi. Hm? My quen yam meaning what goes on there. There is something beyond the sensory perception. And I'm a boy. Gan ni be any. There is something beyond just name out to me touching qua. Whom we ask you. If there are evil spirits, you better believe there is a good divine spirit. We should trust the word of that divine spirit that has been preserved for us here. Now, Sophia um, Dasifa, I think say, some of these lessons there. Kenya ne da yepe. Question back home so I've been trying to reconcile 
ene eh, Genesis 1. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth, and the earth was formless. Yesu ya sabasku ubiya etre and say, what, what beginning is this beginning? This beginning is the creation of earth. What about the creation of the universe in general? And I said this earth mentioned here includes all other earths. It, that is a question I so may, may try to say. Because when God went on to create the form on the earth. It is this earth we were then talking about for the six days. Now, what about the other earths and what is their beginning? Yeah, I we uh, area of the Old Testament scholars, you know, but omu omu can say that phrase you know, heavens and earth. You know, omu use Hebrew from merizimus, a uh, merizim be. Yeah, a tie happen to indicate the universe. And the story is about the universe because the Bible you know, is talking about the earth within the context of this universe. Because you say, uh, this universe in what's the can. The rest of the, the kind of unfalling world, they are there, and yet, and we'll come with It is this universe. Yes, Ella. Um, so, so the, so the question here, especially the passive uh, gap, gap, no? Sorry, no. I think it, it makes a lot of sense too. Mm -hmm. But my question is, why would God have that form, do unfilled, unformed, and have to allow the Holy Spirit to hover around it? For whatever number of years, why? Why? What is the rationale behind it? Why would God do that? Um, and the second thing, not my answer, no. Okay. And they said, "Well, now class here, go here, guess where you are now." I said, "There is always a time for God to do something." I don't know. Yes, you came from twelve years now. I'm in the ministry now, twenty thirty-one. Do you hear? Hear? And God was waiting for the right was, but the boy, at the end of the day. And I said, yes, you say, yes, you say, yeah, I want another one. Yeah, but I'm just saying that way there, <laughs> in Nippo, we say, in Nippo, it had, nothing has happened. Uh -huh. But the Holy Spirit was hovering, was covering, was controlling, was overseeing. That's what I just want to know, say, before yeah. I hear him. Of course, I understand, say, <laughs> I mean, time. But the, the fullness of time was the, come. The other thing is also that, but this morning, afternoon, after church, I was speaking with a doctor. And you, you told me something very profound. Or say, almost that say, um, almost science, biology class, anatomy of Nipa, anyway. So it's really in our power. Sometimes, before all practicing, he felt that, and the quantity class in Nipa, because they seem to understand the various we know in anatomical we know. Say the nipa you say we can't bomb you say we know. Then man should not. But Oba Oba practicing when he was faced with reality, he realized it. It's not what he thought. Mm -hmm. So I'm just saying that to be say there's limitation in BBI the understanding. Say the opinion of the country. Say if there's anything I don't know about the Bible. Ah, my me get to me say Bible. No, your Bible. No, they say. Science if one one last two years one one week. It, no matter what it is, it means in effect to say there's there's the likelihood that there's that power beer ye ye behind. Like you said, any pa F or B or Bay Mwa. When does sa ye and when does even uh, the Cards and not start from me. They may see. But you see, it's amazing. Say, so, doctor, from my boy, because one start. I don't think quickly now. A commander form. I know. One of the things a form very Do quickly. Doctor, there. Why, doctor, be more. I don't know. A corano. Well, for one, quickly now. Heart in a decline. And I just say, not in a son and yamana. But why is that? And how do they know? Say they should do that. So basically, 
blood is what supplies, what supplies the oxygen for all the other parts to form, right? And the heart is what is going to pump the blood to all the other parts. So basically, that's why it's, it's the first one to start, so that energy or um, the nutrients. And so <laughs> if you say, how does it start? <laughs> I would not be able to tell how, how does it start, right? Please, so but it is so mysterious, I said. A dear way here, or more frasiano, Nipa, when you crown to me from whom you spare, no, not yet. Within a month or six weeks, you know, no more to me, I'm going to say. And I'm saying, I'm not can you now be here, Mojenti. Mommy, I'm from heart, my face. Nadia can't bow when you're Moja. I mean, anyway. Um, myself, uh, I'm very privileged to be here, you know. I've always asked myself, uh, um, as you you said, um, you the big man theory. Mm -hmm. You know who created, who really created the that head, yeah, that head structure. I've always been asking. You know, it's a rhetorical question, though. Um, just in the in the in the in the lesson, you, know, you mentioned um, one man who who threw religion, okay, believing in in um, in the Bible. Um, Going to Arizona, the yes, at, at Chadwick, yes, the observations he made, mm -hmm. you know. So it, it, it hits me to, to tell me that, um, uh, then, then before anything, before you presuppose anything, something should really be there. You should really be on something. You, you can't really presuppose something without you believing in something. It is, <laughs> see, we used to be told that there was something called the tabula rasa. That when we come to knowledge, our, our brains are empty. No. You cannot think without something being there already. Sure. That's what you are trying to say. Yes. Yes. So now, so now the, the question goes to say, uh, what I want to ask, really ask is, so with um, the pioneers, Newton and what, what was really their, their basics? You, you see, we can't, we can't, we can't seem to uh, agree with them that, um, they, these are people who didn't have anything, any agenda. These are people who were pure-minded, and you know uh, that, that that that's what uh, it means. They really, they really knew something. There, yes. there was so. Um, and currently, as I'm standing here, um, I believe I believe in God. I believe in the Bible. You see. So now, when I look at some of the ideas they are raising, and in your in in, in the lectures, you made us understand that this is. Some of the things they are trying to, you know, manipulate their ways to agree on sexual, um, you know, the homosexuality. Yeah, those mm -hmm. those things. Mm -hmm. And and I also thought about the um, they they even, um, the the theory that says that okay, this from the fishes, then the fishes came out, uh, and then mm -hmm. evolution. Yeah. So that even that idea alone can tell it's it, it would make you understand that even human beings, we we are ever we evolving some way. So it will get to a time even if I see my fellow man, we are evolving, like something can, it is normal. You know, mm -hmm. so, uh, and currently as I'm here, I know that there is good, there is difference between good and evil. Mm -hmm. So then, it tells me that, really there is an agenda. Yes. And if you, if, if you don't, if you, you don't make your mind to, to, uh, to, to accept something, you will fall for everything. Exactly. Yeah, part of the agenda is also our egos. Because, you know, um, in the scholarly world, this is what happens. Once I have a PhD in a discipline, I have, I have vested my everything in this. You want to take that thing out of me? I'm going to fight tooth and nail. Most of these scientists have made a name for themselves. And you want to bring a theory that kicks my theory out? They will fight it. So part of the agenda is a defense of their egos also. This is why it becomes difficult sometimes for some of them, even for some of our Adventist um, scientists. They can't stick their necks. They can't stick their necks. Because when they stick their necks and say some of the things I'm saying here, they will tell them, you are a scientist and you are saying this. What, what came over you? They will be ridiculed. So in some meetings, you see them quiet. They won't voice anything. We will say that theologians will talk and talk and talk. They will look at us and they go away. They are struggling with their sense of ego and their scholarship. Part of the agenda. 
Yeah. Okay, Pastor, thank you. Um, yes. My question is on Genesis 1. Um, in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. And you, you said it, there's a, I think there's a Hebrew. The merism. Yeah. They call it a merism. But when you come to verse 2, it looks like it singles out the earth and then begins to, um, by saying the earth was without form and void. Mm -hmm. From what you were saying, it appears to me that that's heaven where we, we see the sun, the moon, it's part of the earth. It's that part of the system, the, the universe. Uh -huh. So if, in saying the heavens and the earth and coming down to only speak of the earth, mm -hmm. that heaven there in the verse 1, the heavens there, what is it in reference to? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's in reference to the universe. So it didn't have that problem of being void, being um, formless. When it was created, when it says God created and it was without form and void, that's what it's talking about. When you actually, you know, when, when you come to people ask these questions, so there was let there be light. And then you come down and then God creates the sun and the moon. And people are asking, what is this light? Because the sun is part of the universe, right? Some of these biblical theologians, the Old Testament guys, have actually shown that the Hebrew language, when it says that then God created the bigger sun to rule the day, the language really means that God allowed the sun that was already there to perform its duty and not bring it. So I'm saying that you can see that the verse 1 is talking about the universe, including the sun, which later on, if that interpretation is true, God allowed to perform its functions. Yeah. Yes. Uh -huh. Exactly. I think Elder Frank is at the back. Pastor, I was just adding to um, Kwame's question. Mm -hmm. When he says God created the heavens and the earth and said the earth was without form, um, some believe that the heavens and the earth, the heavens part was or is where God is now, mm -hmm. the heavens. And that one was with form, that one was filled. Before now, the earth was without form. So is that um, theory correct? The, the problem I'll have when you extend it to, to God, to where God dwells, that would then be the beginning of God. That, that becomes problematic. I think that there is a prehistory before Genesis where God's dwelling, the rest of the planets and so forth, we don't have the record here. So I think, like they said, the merism, well, I'm not an Old Testament scholar, but they will show it. That's a merism that happens many times. And then the preponderance of cases, it is referring to our universe. And heavens. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, anybody? No woman is speaking. What happened to you? Okay, here. There is a lady here. Let the lady speak first. Okay, okay. Pastor, I think um, the what you said about what the scientists are saying from geology and all that is coming up now, mm -hmm. that the world has been there for like over 4 billion years. Mm -hmm. um, from what we are deducing from Genesis right now, some believing that maybe the world without form already existed for some years. Mm -hmm. Could it not really affirm that the world existed um, some years before and that world is... That, that's world without form is actually what they are referring to, not the beginning of us. Yeah. I don't know if you get my question. Exactly. That's what I was saying. So, when I said that science is nudging theology into a certain way, this is what is causing the Old Testament scholar to see exactly what you are saying. That there is actually no discrepancy. I mean, if the interpretation is right, 
There's no discrepancy between the truth, the claims that science is making for 4.6 billion and the fact that before the pre-Cambrian, you know the pre-Cambrian, the pre-Cambrian is when you go to the geological record, that's where you see fauna and little animals beginning. Before the pre-Cambrian, there's nothing. There are no fossils. So what they are saying is that there doesn't have to be necessarily a conflict between what science is seeing and what Genesis is seeing. And this period, the passive gap period, may then explain the 4.6 billion years. But then we come to this question. Why would God wait for so long before he, he does it? Yes. Well, um, some are going to fight with you on that belief because we fight with it at our office also. There are some who believe in the no gap theory. God has power. He can say it. And like Adam, when he rose up and he was like maybe 200 years, God can say it and the thing becomes like 4.6 billion years. There are some who believe that. Yes, at the back. Okay, Pastor. Part of my question is answered. Okay. But I still have, uh, I mean, a question at the, on the Genesis chapter 1, verse 2. The darkness. The earth was without form and void and darkness was on the face of the deep and the spirit of the Lord hovering over the face of the waters. So my question is, the Addison uh, chapter, the verse one says, in the beginning, God created. So before the creation, there was nothing. So who came uh, from? Uh, hold on. Who came from that hold, darkness? Hold it, hold it. Before creation, there was God. <laughs> before creation, there was God. So you cannot say before creation, there was nothing. I wanted to know, that where was the darkness came from? Where did they came from before so that? When God created and it was formless and void and the deep, that is when the darkness was. Wow. <laughs> okay. Um, let's see Dr. B. What you do. Let some of the scientists help us out, please. Thank you very much. Um, for me, yeah, cancer science, uh, I think uh, it has to do with asking questions mm -hmm. and then trying to find answers. Now, my problem, Kakran, is uh, how far do you ask those questions? Mm -hmm. And at what point do you stop? I think that is where the problem is. Yes. Because um, I feel, sir, when I started, because people questioned the existence of God, mm -hmm. and then they would want to prove. But it's very difficult to do that, like you mm -hmm. said, because you can't, you can't do it. Mm -hmm. uh, for example, now these two speculations in the Adventist church, something there's a passive gap, something there's no passive gap. How do you prove it? It's, it's very difficult. So at best, the two schools are speculating yes. that probably it happened. So there are some things you just will not be able to answer them scientifically. But you realize that science has also done well mm -hmm. in a lot of things. If you take medicine, some time ago, uh, we felt, oh, and that was it. Mm -hmm. But eventually, we got to know that, oh, when you have either a liver failure or kidney disease, that is when you have those things, and there's treatment for it. It's good to ask questions. And it appears that religion some time back was... Stifling. Yes, yeah. wasn't allowing that. And that is why people tried breaking free, you know, so that they could ask their questions and all that. In how far do we go? I mean, and at what point? My wife thinks that because uh, she doesn't think it adds to salvation in any way. Mm -hmm. Eventually, if she gets explanations to some of these things, she be happy. Yes. <laughs> how far do we go? I mean, 
And at what point do we say, say, okay, we don't have explanation to it. But it's also uh, dangerous to say we don't have explanation to it because some people have pushed. Yes. And they've gotten explanations at yeah. very high level. So that, that is it for me. I mean, that's what I'm battling with. Yeah. How far do we go? What answers should we accept, sir? Okay, this is it. We can't go far. I think, I think the farthest we go is as far as biblical presuppositions would allow. If I'm stepping beyond a point where I'm going to fight biblical presuppositions, then I've gone too far. But if I have not crossed positions that are not um, incompatible with the Bible, then I'm, I'm free to ask those questions. Uh, last last um, example. You know, we have people who are out of touch with reality, mm -hmm. who have mental illness. Sure. I once went to the Accra Psychiatry and some are very convincing. The antennas, they hear, they hear, send messages and all yeah. that. And sometimes I ask myself, I mean, so at what point will you say that this person is out it's of sin. touch <laughs> with reality? It's very difficult to, you yeah. know, but you might convince yourself, okay, maybe because of certain things you are doing, okay, you would probably brand them as, as having mental illness. But it's very difficult differentiating who really is making sense, okay, sometimes if you really try to put yourself into their shoes, into the conversation, and then who is, is, is not making sense or... Yeah, I know, you know, I've always joked with my wife. Do you realize that some, there's sometimes a closeness between insanity and extremely religious people? Have you noticed that? People who go to extremes in religion. There is a certain closeness to insanity. And then you talk about also autism. Autistic. I mean, when people have a little dose of autism, they become extremely brilliant. Why is that? These are boundaries we don't know. So, anyway. Um, Elder, how far are we going now? It's almost quarter to six. Yes, here. Yeah. Okay, so we'll take this one as the last question here. Master, thank you so much for today's lessons. Um, I was doing a Bible studies with someone, and we begin with Genesis. We struggle to have more details on what we learn today. But if I have learned all these things, I will know how to cope with that person. He asked me a question, and I want us to share. I don't know if somebody has an uh, uh, idea or answer. He said that, who wrote Genesis? And what time did he who wrote it? So I just want to have, ask the, the house if anyone can give us answer before you theology you come in. Who wrote Genesis? And where did he wrote it? Um, can we take up that question another time? I know it is important to you, but it's really not germane to our discussion here. Let us talk about that okay. another time. And then what he says that mm -hmm. we as Christians, we take things just blankly. We don't know the other side. And I gave him text from Deuteronomy 29, 29. And he was surprised. He's a Christian too. He stated that the secret things belong to, unto the Lord, our God. But those things which are revealed belong unto us and our children forever. That we may do all the ways of his law. So he said that, well, if that is so, then what the scripture is saying is true. But he want to find out, there are couples of questions that if we reach, 
we understood what he want to apply to uh, what they call uh, physical, religious, and uh, what they call it, uh, science. The person is a medical officer, yeah. so he knows what he's about. But end of the day, some of the answers have been answered. Thank yeah. you, sir. I think just like the doctor said, because sometimes we quote that text to silence people. Um, we shouldn't be drawing the curtain too quickly. Some of our children are going to go to MIT and all these schools and they are studying astrophysics and things like this. You want to minister to them too in a way that will make sense to them. I mean, they, we get to a point where we can go further. We know, but we shouldn't bring the curtain down too soon. Thank yeah. you very much. And thank you for your attention. Oh, Vato, before you close, just a quick one. Uh, so the question is, how, how should we take science? In fact, in Christianity, when science tends to explain or explanation from science conforms with our beliefs, we clap. Mm -hmm. I think one of these scientists who said, when you study even the eye, human eye, you cannot afford but believe that there is a divine Darwin himself came exactly. to that conclusion, yes. Then we will clap. That's his affirming. How do we take it? Yeah, we clap when it affirms. Yeah. But then we are saying that when what they say steps beyond biblical data, then we have a problem because our worldview is formed by the Bible and we can't afford to lose that. Sometimes they push us to points where they are trying to understand something which the Bible is silent on. But the fact that the Bible is silent on doesn't mean that what they are saying should be the ultimate truth. I think science needs some humility. Science needs to understand that it has blind spots. The problem is that sometimes science too, is too arrogant. It needs to be humble. Yeah. Um, so, Pastor, thank you so much. Um, I think this has been a very fruitful session. If I'm sure Pastor doesn't remember, but this question which we answered today, I asked Pastor about it for well, seven years ago when we were in Washington. <laughs> and he said, know we be, we know we be. So I've been thinking about it and pondering about it for a long time. I, I think the conclusion that we have arrived at it gives us assurance that we can still affirm the Bible as authentic word of God. And whatever the Bible says is what is true. Science is trying, and it also tells us that science is not totally wrong. Science is not totally wrong, but there are areas where science will have to up its game a bit. So we thank God for this teaching, and we believe that it has addressed a lot of issues on our mind. Shall we take a hymn and open to hymn number 21, SDH 21? Immortal, invisible. Thank you. 
Shall we pray? Father, we thank you for the exposition and the revelation you've given us today. You have helped us to place our faith and religion in contest. Science will say whatever it has to say, but let us be grounded in the knowledge that you are ruling and you continue to rule above. May you help us as we develop within all this contest that our faith will not be shaken, but rather be strengthened. That when you come, you come to find a group prepared for your soon coming kingdom. We thank you for the health and strength of pastor. We thank you for the knowledge you've given him. Keep him in good shape so that we'll continually tap in the knowledge that he has. Now we commit the rest of the day into your hands. We thank you for the blessings of the Sabbath, we thank you that you will take us home safely, and we thank you that you bring us back when the time is due. We've asked all these and other blessings in your son's name have we prayed with thanksgiving. Amen.